So who was that guy getting so much attention from the media this morning? By George? That was John, as in John F. Kennedy Jr. And to sort this out just a little bit further, George is the name of a magazine he started. Bertha Coombs has details. The premiere issue of George looks red hot with supermodel Cindy Crawford on the cover and a lot of big name advertisers inside. A very big launch in no small part because John F. Kennedy Jr. is editor in chief. Certainly it helps and it draws attention and what any new launch needs is that. Uh, but ultimately this magazine is going to stand or fall on whether or not it's a good magazine. The magazine aims for a hip look at politics without heavy partisan ideology. What it won't have is gossip about Paul's or John Jr., who addressed rumors of his engagement to girlfriend Caroline Bassett right off the bat. The answers to the most frequently asked personal questions are as follows. Yes, no, we're merely good friends, none of your business. Honest, she's my cousin from Rhode Island. I've worn both, maybe someday, but not in New Jersey. John Jr. seemed to enjoy the banter with the press much as his father Jack did in the White House. If his mother Jackie were still alive, he says she'd enjoy seeing him succeed. I think that uh, my mother would be mildly bemused. I think that she'd be glad that she wasn't standing up here. <laughs> And I think that she'd be very proud. Kennedy and his partners say launching George has been stressful, but success is taking the edge off. The first two issues have more than 100 pages of advertising, and already they're planning to make the bi-monthly magazine a monthly venture after the first year. In Lower Manhattan, I'm Bertha Coombs, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Uh, George, we'll have to see if it works. And that's Eyewitness News at Original. 5. Original. Thanks right. for tuning in. For uh, What's Your Name and Sam Champion and the rest of the Eyewitness News team, I'm Greg Hurst. The news continues now with Bill Butel. Yes, bye, George. <laughs>